why they have a lead in this one. We'll be back in a moment. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. A chance to get a quick injury report. Let's check in with Allie LaFour. She has an update on Kristaps Porzingis. What do you have, Allie? Thanks, guys. I got a status report from the Celtics head athletic trainer. All signs point to a high ankle sprain, something that they're going to have to be very careful with. He won't return tonight or anytime soon. This injury will knock him out for an extended period of time. B.A.? Okay, thanks for the update. Good to get that information. Now we know. how things are coming along Grant that's true it's the uncertainty factor with injuries that can be so hard to handle and you never want to speculate so it's nice for us and especially his teammates to get some facts and for Chicago let's take a look they've got Derrick Rose and it's Rodman in at the four spot now here's Tatum give him eight points now pass to Brown 4-3, deflected, and it's going to be out of bounds. Boston will have another go, and that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. Oh, now that was a block. Some much-needed energy there to jumpstart them back into this game. And for those tuning in, we're about a minute into this second half. Clock at four. Let's it go from deep. And it's Tatum missing. White against Jordan. Brown with the steal. Off they go. It's a three-on-one break. And Holiday powers it home. And striking without warning. Holiday can be so sudden. Here's Rose. Ten points for him. Right around a minute and a half played in the third quarter. Pass to Jordan. Fires the three. The Bulls with another miss. The Celtics with the lead. It's Brown on the wing. He has seven. And it's Tatum missing. And so here is Chicago. Nothing yet for him here in the third quarter. Jordan, and a foul call on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That's on Al Horford. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. Michael Jordan, two shots. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. Throws good. Jordan. And that's good as he hits both shots. Two minutes into the second half of play now. And there's the foul. It'll go on Derek Rose. That's his first foul. Personal foul. First team foul. Back up, back up, back up. 
Horford passes to Brown. Poke loose. And it's stolen by Rose. Here's Pippen. The shot is good. And the assist by Rose. Rose has got his fifth assist in this one. If they keep finding steals like that, they won't be in the hole much longer. And here's Brown for three. Boston no good that time either. And so it's Rose who brings up the ball for Chicago. They've only allowed two points so far in the second half. Pass to Pippen. Rebound Boston. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. Tatum from long range. Jason Tatum. He's a sharpshooter. Not just being selfish, but also smart with the ball. Brown is able to find the best guy for the right shot. Rose, the pass to Pippen. Rose against Holiday. Shot clock at five. to finish it off. A beauty. Playing from behind, it's amazing he chose a dunk with that high a difficulty rating. Yeah, no question. That was a stellar move with plenty of swagger. Now here's Holiday. He's got five. Brown finds Tatum. And it's Chicago with the board. Gilmore's got nine rebounds now. Jordan against Holiday. Jordan, the pass to Rose. No luck on that one. Good work defensively by White. Over Jordan. No fear. Derek White, impressive. That's a shot he loves. Unless it's a guy right in his jersey, he's going to convert. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. Richards checked in for White. And here are the Bulls now. Trailing by eight. Pass to Jordan. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. And a look at how the offensive approach has been going so far for the Celtics. The name of the game in the modern NBA is making threes. Space in the court, and that's exactly what they are doing tonight. Yeah, and their team first approach is another thing you have to like. And they've had great ball movement and are getting a lot of points off assists. Tillman's checked in for Boston. Outside, Brown. Holiday from long range. Rodman with a rebound. Rodman's got four rebounds in the game. Now here's Jordan. He's guarding closely. B.A., forget about attempting the long-range three to cut into that lead. Just attack the rim, my man. Man, that was sweet. Holiday passes to Tillman. Here's Pritchard. Launches it. Nails it from three. Richard's got himself on the board with a three there. If you give a shooter of his skill an opening like this, he's going to take it every time. Jordan misses. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Now here's Rose. He's got ten. There's 48 seconds left in the third quarter. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. <laughs> wow. Rose looking just as tenacious as ever. He isn't intimidated by the close D at all. Taking two shots. And that one falls for Rose. Hauser, he's checked in for Boston. And so Rose knocks them both down. And you'd like to go two for one here, Grant. And at the same time, you want to get a good shot here, B.A. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Jordan. Here's Pritchard. 
and the call is going to be yes That's on an illegal screen. You're not going to fool the officials too often on an illegal screen. That's a very avoidable turnover. You gotta focus on the details. Now here's Rose, guarded closely. Pass to Jordan. That's tipped. Here's Rodman. Back to Jordan. Clock at six. The shot off that time. Nice D from Brown. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. Oh, getting the hoop and the harm. That's tremendous body control from Brown. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for your Celtics. Jalen Brown at the line with one shot. Free throw no good for Brown. Every team in this league wants a Jalen Brown. A tremendous two-way wing and board. Brown can put up giant offensive numbers. He's just an aggressive finisher there inside. Hey, when you got bounce like that, you feel like you can take on anybody. And so it's Boston leading by six as we wrap up the quarter. The flow of the game has favored them in general. But hey, the tide can shift. More NBA on two.